Mm. Yes. Excellent. Uh, oh, you know, I forgot to do that thing with that other thing. Shoot. Look how prepared I am. I got the number right, though. Uh, it's Friday, and feels like I got one foot out the door, because I do. All right. Hello. Welcome to my world. Look at these weird hairs happening here. I don't know. It started off with me leaving the yogurt at home. Is there too many buttons? Okay. It's my pineapple shirt. You can't even see the really light pineapples because they kind of blend in. Can't do a shadow and a... If I move back. Can you see the white ones? No. Oh, well. Hey, look. Got something in the P.O. box today. I hope it's what I think it is. Otherwise, I should have opened it a lot earlier. Oops. Don't trust a grown man with scissors. Look at this Amazon tape. That's pretty cool. I don't remember seeing that before. All right. And it is going to open, maybe. Yeah! Ta-da! It's more of these. It's more LED magnets. Three more sets. You know what that means. Dirty words back there. No, I don't know. And air. Free air. Well, it wasn't free. Cost you something. Part of the shipping and handling, I'm sure. But my shipping and handling was free because I told them to take as long as they wanted. I'm a super saver. I really am a super saver. These were about half price. So my poor wife, who got me the original set for my birthday, we won't tell her. She doesn't watch these anyway. Hey, it's like the Three Stooges. Hello, hello, hello. I should do them now, right? Nah. Should I keep any of this stuff? Why not? I keep everything else. Remember, you can suffocate yourself on plastic. So be sure to throw it away in your small children. To avoid danger of suffocation, keep this bag away from babies and children. Do not use in cribs, beds, carriages, or play pens. Ah, oh, I was going to put it right in the bed. This bag is not a toy. Sure it is. La, 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 la. Look what fun we're having. Discard bag and any other packing materials immediately after removing product. Do not reuse this bag. That's the warning. And then they say it again in Spanish. Advertencia. Para evitar recibir riesgo de sofocación. Mantenga esta bolsa alejada de bebés y niños. No se encunas camas, carriolas o corralitos. Esta bolsa no es un jugu juguete. Juguete. Juguete? I don't really know Spanish. Tire la bolsa y los otros materiales de empaque immediately. Emilia, immediatamente. Immediatamente. No reuse esta bolsa. Hey, it's the closing credits to my movie. Toys are fun, aren't they? All right. Thank God. I threw all the plastic bags away in a giant plastic bag. Well, gosh, these are light. I wonder if it's so easy to get them to me. And it didn't take as long as they said it would. <sighs> All right, let's uh, get to the W. Because I've wasted enough time. I made a Frank reference 
And Flea picked up on it and wanted me to know if I was asking about Frank Jewett, Boston Idol. Yes. Specifically, uh, when I took Frank as my plus one to Super Brawl, courtesy WCW, courtesy Sportsline. Uh, it was uh, as a con. It was to get him to drive me. But we actually didn't even bother going into the Cow Palace parking lot. We parked on the street right outside. And so it really was a free trip, except for whatever the price of gas was at the time. Probably not too bad. It was, what, 01? What was our last year? It was the last Super Bowl. It was actually the last match that Scott Hall was in. So, actually, it wasn't, wasn't Super Bowl Revenge? I can't remember. We'll have to look it up later. But the main event was a triple threat match, which, of course, they didn't call that because it was WCW. It was a three-way dance. They don't call it that either. It was a, not a triangle match. What did WCW call three people matches? Anyway, it was, uh, wow, I can't remember now. Was it Sid? I think. All right, I'm going to look it up. The reason I brought the whole thing up was it, it, it turned out to be Scott Hall's last match in WCW. And he laid on the ring canvas for so long that we had left the Cow Palace and he was still lying down in the middle of the ring. So, you know, Scott Hall, always professional. Super Brawl. I'm going to ProWrestlingHistory.com. I really didn't mean for this throwaway thing to be, yeah, no. So it wasn't Super Bowl Revenge, therefore it must have been Super Brawl 10 in 2000. WCW world champ Sid Vicious beat Scott Hall and Jeff Jarrett in a triangle match when he pinned Hall. There you go. The other thing that was uh, kind of famous about that show was it was the one where Tank Abbott and Big Al had their main event which turned out to be a leather, leather jacket on a pole. It was a skins match. That was the skin. Except, after the match was over, Tank took out a knife, and he was going to skin Big Al. And they had to cut away really quickly. Ah, good times, WCW. We sure miss you. But not enough to start watching Impact Wrestling, although I hear it's good. Anyway... Flea goes on to say, crow about the stock, from 13 to 16 in no time flat. Yeah, all we had to do was dump our CEO. We're now flirting with 17, actually. We closed at 16.80 today. You know, if they had known the stock was going to go up 30%, if they could have just dragged Enrique's tenure out until the employee stock purchase price date. The ESP purchase is the 15th or the 16th. It doesn't matter. It just, it, well, it kind of does matter because if we'd had 30% gain after the 15th, that would have been better for us. But you're still going to get the same amount of money into the same amount of stock. Yeah, numbers. I don't know. It's not like I ever expect the stock to do anything, although I keep buying it. One of these days I'm going to sell it. And then I'll have a little more money. Doug also watched five in a row. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe people watch more than one of these at a time. I can't even watch more than one of these at a time. But that's also because there's no spoilers. You know, it's all spoilers for me because I, I lived it at the time when I, I don't know. CRZ, Redneck Island, and the Olympics. Throw in some NASCAR and my day is complete. Hey, how about that A.J. Allmendinger? Mm. Hey, how about that John West Townley? Ha, <laughs> ha. Once again, Nationwide Series is at Iowa, and I am in Minnesota. But I don't think I'm going to be missing out, missing out too much. And besides, the, the food truck fair is on Sunday morning, so I can't go to a nationwide race on Saturday. What a relief. Greg is multitasking while watching slash listening. Usually work-related. Okay. Doug and Greg both think that handball is basically water polo without the water. Uh, that's an interesting thought, and I haven't watched enough of either during these Olympics to say yes or no. But probably, sure. If you both think so, you're probably right. 
I'm going to watch some Olympics on Monday, though. Uh, I have Monday off. That's to recover from the food truck fair. No, it's to get my paid time off down below a certain level to hold me until I take my big vacation at the end of the month around state fair time. I think I said all this yesterday, too. And I'm out of time, which is just as well, because I ran out of things to talk about before I even started. Thank you for watching this whenever you end up watching it. If not Friday at 6.18 p.m. where the current temperature is 88 degrees, sometime. You'll have an extra day. I won't be here Monday, so there won't be a video on Monday. So tune in Tuesday. God willing, I'll be here. And if not, well, this is a hell of a way to go out, isn't it? I love you. I'll see you next week. Bye.